Today's video is all about Investing 101 or Basics of Investing. This is Arman Benko, Lead Financial Literacy Advocate of the Colaico Foundation and CEO of KSK SMP Co-op, an investment cooperative. Welcome to the Pera Palaguin series here in this YouTube channel. Please do not forget to subscribe in this channel and click on the bell notifications so you will be the first to know of new videos out in this channel. We will appreciate hearing from you, so please feel free to leave your comments below. In managing personal finances, five common activities earning, planning, saving, spending, and investing. What is investing or how shall we define it? It is a commitment to use money, expecting to make more money based on long-term goals. Operative words here are commitment, expecting, and long-term. Commitment. Once you start investing, you are invested almost all your life. You do not invest only if there is extra money or there is a bonus or there is some left over. Once you decide and commit to invest, a regular and if not fixed, regular and increasing amount of money being invested. When you are investing, you are only expecting, hoping, and praying to make more money. Simply put, walang siguradong investment. If one solicits investments from you and says, Ma'am, Sir, invest ka dito, sigurado dito. Only two things why investment solicitor will say that. One is he doesn't know what he is talking about and or two, he is going to scam you or run away with your money. Four things can happen in all kinds or types of investments. Any of these four can happen tomorrow even if you invested in the most popular, previously earning, legit investment instruments or investment vehicles. Of the four possible things that can happen to any kind of investment instrument or vehicle, only one is what we actually desire. At yan yung tayo ay kumita. That is to make money or earn or grow our investment. The next thing that can happen to any of our investment is, and th with this we may start to complain about it already, is that our investment did not earn or grow over a period of time. Yung magre-reklamo ka na, ano ba yan? Limang taon ng pera ko, sampung taon, walang kinita. Then all kinds or types of investments, pwede din malugi, walang siguradong investment. Nagpasok ka ng pera, nung nilalabas mo, mas maliit na ang naibibigay sa'yo o naibigay sa'yo. Nangyayari yan sa kahit anong investment. Last thing that can happen to any of our investment is we completely lose all our investment. Nothing recovered at all. Pwedeng mangyari yan. Investment losses are very different from investment scams. Investment scams right at the onset so, sa umpisa pa lang, you are bound to lose your money. And lucky if you are able to recover some or often your money completely gone. To mitigate the uncertainty in investing, investing should be based on long-term goals. Long-term means minimum of 5 years and up as your investment horizon. To demonstrate that long-term always brings better results, is the actual performance of a mutual fund a favorite investment vehicle for most of us? Shown is the actual performance of the mutual fund partner of KSK SMP Co-op in its regular saving and investing program, Phil Equity Mutual Fund. For a very short period, like six months, actual performance is a decline of more than half percent or negative 0.65%. One-year performance as date indicated, still a decline at negative 8.25%. Meaning, if you placed money 12 months ago and redeemed or pulled out last December 17, 2018, your money is lesser by 8.25% compared to last year when you placed it. 
Now let's talk long term. Minimum 5 years I mentioned. Now your money has grown. Almost 30% or 29.16%. Your 100,000 5 years ago now has a value of 129,160 pesos. Compared to a time deposit in the biggest banks in the Philippines, your money of 100,000 in a time deposit placed 5 years ago is just 105,000 pesos today. Ang layo sa 129,000. The 10-year performance is testament to the investment rule, invest long term. Money in this mutual fund more than quadrupled. Ulet more than quadrupled. The 100,000 10 years ago is 459,000 pesos today. Investing is a commitment to use money, expecting to make more money based on long-term goals. Watch out for the next video. We will discuss basic rules in investing. Leave a comment on the section provided below. For any questions or even suggestions, you want answered or discussed in our upcoming videos. Today's video is all about Investing 101 or Basics of Investing. This is Arman Benko, Lead Financial Literacy Advocate of the Colaico Foundation and CEO of KSK SMP Co-op, an investment cooperative.